Well, after responding to five drownings in Lake Michigan last summer, Racine firefighters are hoping for a safer summer and they have new reinforcements to help them out. Our Madeline O'Neill here in the studio with what they hope will really make a difference. Hi, Madeline. Hi. Yeah, after last summer, firefighters knew they wanted to do something. So with the help of the Racine Rotary Club and local students, they're stocking the beaches with some life saving tools. The lake isn't so welcoming today. It look cold. <laughs> but the promise of summer weather is also carrying in some worry, especially for parents. Yes, I do, especially with the waves. With more people getting out into the water. If you were out deep enough, if you weren't the strongest of swimmers, it would be a bit tough. Last summer we had two dive incidents at this on the same day at the same time. One was here and one was a little bit north at the same exact time. After racing firefighters hurried to the lake for five rescues that ended in drownings last summer, including children. A lot of members have kids, so it's it's very stressful. Lieutenant Brian Terzinski is asking beachgoers to consider using what's in these boxes. We try to preach everybody. I mean, they're there even if you're a good swimmer. The lake is can be pretty dangerous. Firefighters say the free life preservers could help them too. We're here to help and we need as much help as we can get. I guess due to staffing cuts and manpower issues, it can be a struggle. These life vests are available for anyone to use. They just ask when you're done, you return them. It's good that they have those life vests. I think that's a great idea. I've never seen something like that. There are three life preserver bins total, two at North Beach and one at Zoo Beach, built by students from Park High School. Some of them actually knew some of the victims, so it it hit home for them. Drzinski says he hopes this will be enough to help turn the tides toward a safer summer. Enjoy the water, but respect it. While they can't always be there, there are lifeguards at North Beach from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. every day during summer season. Now, cool fact, those bins went into or those bins that went into place at the end of last summer. The students who made them actually took second place in a statewide community service competition and are now heading on to a national tournament in Atlanta this month. Madeline, thanks so much.